Hi guys, this is um, these are a few clips of actually my favorite player, this Japanese number eight, Kazuki Himeno. Um, uh, he does this really cool thing often when um, you're not held on the ground. If you've been tackled, if you're not held, you can actually um, sort of release the ball or quasi release the ball and get up and keep going. Um, and it's a cool way to get a couple extra meters, get a easier clear out. Um, force the gain line, you know, cross the gain line and force the defense back a bit. So I'm just going to show you sort of what he does. Um, here he is off the hit line, gets brought to the ground, but see the nine doesn't hold him. He, uh, excuse me, he rolls away pretty quickly. And so he just picks up the ball and keeps going. And that has to shift those three players, these three players who got set in their defensive line, suddenly they have to shift back and they've got quick ball off that. Anyway. He goes down, again, he's in, he's in red here, he's six. He's not held, so he keeps on going, and what do you know, scores a try. Um, in this clip, playing against England, again, they try to hold him, but he actually 12 gets a good purchase on him, but he's just so strong and powerful, he rips his leg out. Um, and a lot of you, I'm sure, could do that. Picks it up drives Jamie George, who, you know, would have been a tackler in that line. They got to commit one extra guy. They've already got a guy out of the play who just tackled him. Now they have to commit one extra guy, take a step back. They've lost a couple meters. Overall, if 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 you can be sneaky and pull this off without getting called for double movement, because if you're held and, and you do it, then you'll, you'll almost certainly get called for it. Um, could be a really cool move.